Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that frame's too right here. Yeah, and the inside. Yeah, yeah, inside. Yeah. Well, I start taking it out. Look, it's got all kinds of a suit in there. And we'll pop the hood open. Do you want to take the front end? Yeah, let's take the front end off. We have to, all this. Be juicy. Oh, yeah. yeah. Put some more juice. More juice? More juice. Carapilla is going to take the, start taking the cab apart. I'm going to go start putting the harness on the engine. So we have the engine harness already installed. Come check it out. So we're going to take the old harness, the, the OEM harness, and uh, this will be the harness. And then, uh, I'm gonna install the new harness, so at least we got the harness already installed when we put the cab on it, you know what I mean? That's the plan for today. It's gonna be cool, it's gonna be cool, dude. Let me see. Estás usando el impact. ¿Qué pasó? Oye, pues. Good thing about this is we can just stand right here and put the harness on. You know what I mean? Which is like having the cap already on it, and then we have to install the harness. That would be a pain in the ass. More shit in the way. More shit in the way, exactly. You know, it seems like. What are you doing with the harness? Why are you putting the harness on if you're not ready to drive it? And like, because we're gonna get ready to drive it as soon as we fucking put the cap on. That's why. I'm off. Shit. Yeah, this is the crappy part right here. We're gonna have to take off the radiator. Taking off the AC pump because we're not gonna have AC in this. So it's not gonna leave the pump on the you know what I mean? What the fuck? Hey, yes sir. That motherfucker's metric. No, oh, it's standard, what? Standard no 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 I'm using the standard ones. And they don't work? It's on the, the truck now, the stock one is connected with the fuse box. 
and the new harness is not going to be connected with the big box, you know, so it makes it more simple to use. So you put in a whole new fuse box too? Yeah, it has its own fuse box. So this is where the ECU, EC amp is, and this is going to be the new fuse box. This is going to be the ignition, and then all the injectors. It looks more complicated than what it really is. We're going to do the fuel line, everything that needs to be ran through it. That way when the cap goes over it, we're not sitting there struggling underneath, you know what I'm saying? I'm not mistaken, this guy right here, oops. This dude right here goes right here. There you go. What's that? That's the, the GPS, throttle position tent. Oh. Goes right here. Okay. So I'm gonna go right here. Uh -huh. Okay. Right there. Where's the spray? It's over here from this side. The bolt's right here. Look. It's right there. Right here. It's a fucking bolt. Yeah, but uh, right here's the nut. Motherfucker, Look, dog. Like You're that. not a fucking yo ghetto. Yeah, homie. watch it. Watch it. Go nugget. get the juice. Go get the juice. Uh Son desde aquí, güey. Did you take this side off? No, I don't think so. Come on, I took some of it. Come on, I took some of it. Come on, I took some of it. Yeah, just take a note of that. 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 Take a note of that.
What's up, homie? Here we are. Get this shit on, homie. It's just driving me insane. This pinchy yogurt, homie, is giving us a hard time. But you know what? Ain't nothing gonna bring us down, homie. Let's just keep going trucking. Literally trucking. Oh yeah. See, that's what's holding the grill on the front. What's this? Don't throw this away. What is this for? It's lo que agarra el rallador así. What's up with the grill? Ya estuvo, que pedo? The fuck is the lado, no? No, the fucking food grill, cabrón. Oh. Sound pitchy wet or <laughs> at least they took care of the carburetor. Look at they covered it up with a with a fucking dirty ass rag. So it's a pillar. Give me a 916. A wrench. 916. Wrench. Wrench. No way. The fucking regular one. Regular one. Give me the cutter to cut this. Don't throw it away. Let's be a cool little shifter, huh? Hold on. Get jacked up. That's it. Do the other side. We're gonna back it up and see if we can lift it with the four. Okay. You see me talking? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> talking right now, homie. What the fuck? This oh, fool. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's use the chain, though. Bring the chain. You're right. Tie it up. Uh, yeah, we're going to push it back. We're going to try to lift it up. And then we're going to slice some two by fours. See if we can get the cab off with the forklift from here. See how that shit works out. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's fuck tape. around. Come on. Stop fucking around. What do you need pressuring tape for? Let's put them open so we can grab it from here. There it is, right there. 
Hey, stop. Ahí déjale los fork pues.
gonna put it over here. You know what I would do if I was you right now? Stop what you're doing. Here okay, we go. Just stop what you're doing right now. Look. Here we go. Get this on film. No. This plant is lying right here. Right here is what you can do. Cross. That's what I was thinking. Right you know there. that's, that's exactly funny? Exactly you know what I was thinking? I was thinking the same shit. Even though the lips so you can attach it to it. Then I can make the sheet metal. Yeah! Hold up. Gangsta shit. I love it. Yeah, we do. Hey, pick it up from the front right there. Mommy. Make yourself easy. Pick it up a little. I'm going to slide this way. Oh, hell yeah, dog. Big Jeep. That's how deputy dog right there, homie. Don't say Big Jeep. Oh, no, homie, it'll go on there. It just needs a little fucking connecting. Oh, shit, what kind of marker is that? <sighs> Holy shit. Fucking Bellows Customs, dog. Bellows Customs, dog. I'm gonna cut it right there. I'm gonna go right here. You know what I would do if I was here? You know what I would do if I was here? nine feet.
he's hitting the tire. All right. What'd you hear, your nose? Am I good? See this cross member? So, so the body comes to about here. So we gotta put another cross member here because you need a cross member. So we'll put another one here. And then we'll chop it from here. So we'll be able to clear everything. It'll make, it, it'll make it easier for me to get in there too because this shit's all in the way. So once all this is out of the way, we can get in there, get in there good, you know? We're gonna integrate the radiator, intermix the radiator mount with the body mounts. I'm gonna run some bars all the way across holding the body and they make some tabs to hold it down. Everything in this fucking car is like heavy duty. Here's the thing with this, you can't take this off until you put one on there. If you take this off, this could spring open. You know what I mean? So, that's like super important. We're gonna make this shit work, huh, man? <laughs> that's what we do around here, bro. There ain't no fucking ifs or buts, honey. That's that shit that I'm talking about, the stinking shit. <laughs> oh, fuck. We're gonna make some caps to put right here. I cut it a little bit uneven because it's not so easy to cut right here, but I'm gonna even it out and we'll put some caps here, you know. Figured out. I, I noticed that we still have an inch off the ground on the front of the body, and I'm thinking, why wouldn't it go all the way down, right? Because we wanted to lay, right? Lay rocker. 
We're not gonna cheat nobody out of a fucking an inch, homie. So check it out. What I noticed is, see right there? The body's hitting the top of the air. You know, just a, like a little bit, enough to keep that, keep it that inch off the ground, homie. We're gonna chop it a couple inches back. That way we can get that bam, bam you know what I'm saying? On the ground, homie. Little genius. This little motherfucker right here, though. Still not quite, huh? Fuck you, bitch. What's it hitting now? Damn. Oh my god. What's it now? That shit's still hitting, dude. Structural for body mounts, you know. So I'm thinking I'm gonna make it out of tubular, you know, maybe one and one and a quarter, or some tubing like this, you know. Then make like a cage go forward to where the body sits on it, and then make body mounts off that, you know. That's my goal. I think we can do it. How many body mounts did this thing have? Or it had a. Uh, Actually, it only had three body mounts. It's here in the back, which is here. And then it's kind of weird how this thing kind of sat because it had a frame, uh, a, a bracket made like this. So it only sat right here and then it has two in the front one. So it's three, like a triangle. And then it has these little rubber mounts right here where it kind of teeter totted on it, you know? So that's kind of sort of how I'm gonna do it. So I'm gonna I'm gonna bend some tubing, coming like this, and then I'm gonna make a little mount right here with the little plate right here, so it can like teeter, kind of do, do the same thing, you know. And then I'll reinforce it and build a cage over it. Try to put the air tanks right here, and then we'll go from there. There's still a lot to do, a lot. What I want to do is still though, move the cap forward about maybe an inch or three quarters of an inch forward. I feel like it needs to go forward. So, trying to figure out how to move it forward. What's blocking it? I can see what it is right there. I don't know if you can see here. See right there, it's still hitting the air arm right there. So it's not letting me go forward anymore. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see it. See it? So, I have to raise the cab up again from the front and then really get in there and cut it off. You know, be clear, clear, clear the, that little area because it's just fucking with me, you know? It's kind of cool though because it has a hole here. I get to fix the hole now.
saying, look what's wrong. Hopefully we'll be able to move the body back to court. The mounting plate right here, which is two bolts, we'll cut out a bracket and put a bracket there, and we're gonna go this way. Like this down, like that. 57 inches, and then from here, we'll attach from here and go to the front. And we're gonna come out over here. So we should come out through here, along the frame right here and then we'll do a bend here and attach here and then we'll once we get get it all the measurements correct we'll go ahead and raise the body up and build reinforcements oh shit <laughs> to be one. Then we got the first cross member made. What we'll do is we'll make a bracket from here, wrap around this way, weld it here, weld it here. We'll put a reinforcement we can't go too high here because the box sits right here. So we'll put a reinforcement from here to here. And then we'll make the tubular coming off of here with the little bracket holding the cab right here. I think this is what's gonna be the most work. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> it's all fucking work and shit. Now uh, once we get rolling, we'll get rolling. Let me clean up this area, we'll tack this, we'll get some measurements here, and then we'll make those brackets. This will go pretty quick. Two and three quarters. This is a cool little tool, because it gives you an idea how much you need to notch the pipe to be more accurate.
It's a bump stop, basically? It's just a bump stop right here. So we're just gonna get our angle right here so we can make a little another one of these but right here. And then we'll cut it flat and we'll put a little plate on top. And then we'll cut out our bracket right here. And that's gonna be like what's gonna keep it stable. <laughs> Get down here, I can't see. I can't see an accurate number. Cab again, we'll weld it all up. Okay. Ooh, it's a long, it's like five feet long. Now we're gonna drop it here and we'll weld it here, you know, somewhere. So it's gonna be like a, a big U shaped one again? Or yeah, it's gonna, gonna, it's to gonna go sh connect to the one that's shaped like a U over there, and then we're gonna run it across. And then we're gonna do a bend here and then weld it somewhere around here wherever we can drop it at. 
see right there will be straight ahead and see where it's at it's too far away from the body right here so I kind of wanted to run along this side piece right here like that you know somewhere either in the inside or the outside so it looks like we're gonna have to throw a bend over there see right here that's where I want to make my mount at so I want to run the tube coming out this way and then we're gonna to have to do a bend here, bam. Say something. That's not how you use the fucking ha 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 ha. <laughs> You're gonna you break it. Isn't that what it's for? <laughs> Slide it in. You gotta pick it up a little bit. I'm sorry. I forgot. Come on here. Come on here. There you go. I'm gonna put a line where it needs to be and just match them up. Okay. Okay. Now I gotta mark it right here so we can cut it to where it like fits just right. That's kind of cool how some people defend me on the video, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God, dude, it's there already. Perfect. Nothing but perfection. Let me see. Jack. Yep. I'm gonna call you my lucky charm. Homie. <laughs> Are you Irish? Yeah. There you go. Give me lucky charm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Perfect, though. <laughs> body mount for the front of the cab that way we can get the cab all mounted up and take the cab back up be attached to the tube running across the bottom of the cab so I'm gonna 
So, so the two tubes are coming this way. I'm making tabs coming out the side to the front. Check it out, Mr. Bucket. It's good. So here's the here's the tubing. We're gonna weld it right here. Ba bam. Turn it on, Papa Chulo. Getting ready to weld. do now is get the angle drill drill the hole you know what I mean that way we know where it's gonna come out but we gotta drill it from the bottom like I do, I, I kind of like a little bit like I do what I was doing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs>